bad things will be gone, the good remains. I will walk this world, will walk this world. I will walk this world, will walk this world with you. Okay, so we met um, by our friend Alan. Um, we both, neither one of us were looking for anything when it happened. Um, I grew up always telling people I would marry an Amish guy, and little did I know that it was actually going to happen. So. Yeah. I always, when I was still Amish, I always told me, since I was 15, I always told me I'm going to, sometime, whenever I turn 18, I'm going to leave the Amish, I'm going to get me an English girl. And I was always wanting one, like she is. Even though she's sometimes a little crazy, but <laughs> I still love her though. When we first went, friend Alan, we went out and then we went to the horse and we went racer riding and stuff like that. And we just, and here we are today. So you guys first met at the horse sale? And now, I, my friend Alan, then we first date, we went to the horse sale and just hung out. Okay. What, what, what town did you guys meet in? Lawrenceburg. Lawrenceburg, Tennessee. Yes. What was the uh, what was the first feeling that you both felt when you first laid eyes on each other? Uh, he was definitely not what I was expecting to show up. <laughs> Clean cut. I showed up in a big truck and I was like, wow. <laughs> I just, uh, it was more than I expected. I was actually in shock. Well, I, I was shocked because it was the dream of my girl. <laughs> How old are you guys? I'm 25. I'm 22. Okay. What is one uh, physical, it can be a spiritual, it can be a emotional, one one uh, thing that you most adore about each other? Um, I adore how hard he works. He never complains each day. Even when I'm working, he comes home and still does the housework as well. I adore her because she works five days a week and she comes home and still will help me in the house and stuff like that. Okay. What's one thing you can't stand about each other? <laughs> <laughs> Probably that he, um, when, probably that he sends Snapchats to my friend when I'm doing crazy things and she screenshots everything to save it. Well, <laughs> she just likes to take crazy pictures of me and send it to her friends. Nothing bad, but. <laughs> no, he probably can't stand that I snore constantly, oh, yeah. and he takes videos of that as and well. She, she snores. <laughs> she snores when before she goes to sleep, and I couldn't hardly can't hardly sleep. <laughs> <laughs> what what is uh? You guys have a restaurant, a place to go dine, your favorite spot? <clears throat> probably we go to the Brass Lantern in Lawrenceburg the most. That or Strikers yeah. in Lawrenceburg. That's pretty much our hangout. He what? thinks that I'm not going to get tired of the Amish, and I still like to ride through and see him, and he gets tired of it. <laughs> yeah, that's another thing. I get tired. She wants to go see the Amish every weekend. I grew up there. <laughs> um, what's, what is your favorite food that you guys both... I know you want to go, you go there to eat, but like, what's the, what's the first thing you order when you get there that you want more than anything? Probably your normal chicken tenders and fries for me. Steak. Ribeye steak. They got they got a pretty good. Uh, 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 I had it there before. It's a uh, 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 prime rib. It's yeah. really good there. <laughs> it is. Okay, so if there was one thing that you could tell each other, ten years from now, ten years from now, the person that you are ten years is watching this right now. What are you going to tell yourself? That I'm happy that I made the right choice that I did, and I'm with the person I'm supposed to be with. Same here. <laughs> okay. Well, on three, you guys can look at each other and just say you love each other, okay? So, one, two, three. I love you. I love you. Yes. <laughs> Perfect. Perfect. <laughs>